My friends, welcome back. We are playing as the uh, United Federation of Planets, of course. Uh, I've changed some of the names. Uh, as you can see over here, we've got Wargler, we've got uh, Double Agent Terran. Um, Piacorus is in. Uh, Lightning Phoenix I added. And, and a bunch more, and a bunch more. Uh, like um, the Windslayer Gaming. Also um, a, a streamer, I believe. Oh, yeah, I don't can't remember precisely if he also has a YouTube channel. If he does, then uh, hey, by all means, just uh, look him up in the comment sections. There's some uh, some aware uh, in the series. So as you can see, everything is here. This building quite a bit. I want to make sure that we got a lot more research, and we're therefore focusing a lot more on, on um, getting these um, these things changed. Like commercial, like education, and more education, and agricultural, all of these things. So we can actually let the AI do whatever it, it does be best. Let, let's just say best. Let's be positive for the ones. Uh, we have a distress call that we um, we are sending someone over there. And we have a three-year mission awaiting over here. Who's going there? Are you going there? Um, yes, you... Ah, oh, yes. Arrow's pointing this direction, so he is going there. Which is rather nice, so this could go. We have resource storages of four. Oh, that's annoying. Look at that. Don't know why, everything um, actually is uh, reset to um, the standard standard thing. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's something that I um, was hoping not to have to deal with but uh, I'm hoping that I did change my audio things correctly that it's not annoying for you in any way no more than usually at least so what I want to be doing in this episode is definitely definitely make sure that we get the fleet growing uh, we're part of this uh, this golden concord right now and I'm thinking integrating these guys would most likely be the very first thing that we need to be doing, considering they are, well, not on very good terms with the Romulans, and they are, well, pathetic in any way, shape, or form. Do we need to do a research thing here, the equivalent on that? I hope to change that. I've been told so many times that I need to change my research. Uh, focus on that. Focus on your research. Why didn't you focus on your research? Well... I am me, of course, and, and I do make a lot of mistakes. So let's get rid of this. Let's get... Let's see, how's the fleet looking? So you're at full strength. 7632, 7632. We still need about 3,000 to get to our full two fleets. This would put us you in a You have to visit good... the amusement center in Lacarian City. You won't regret it. No, <laughs> I won't regret it. Um, we'll, uh, we'll definitely increase over here. Let's go... To a higher speed. Agilitarian, that's annoying. Let's get all of this gone. Oh man, I hate these. I seriously do. Like, come on, why why do you have to tell all of these? Uh, we'll accept that we're making five. We'll accept this because we're making more than enough. Let's get rid of that. And we got the new computer. Sweet. We're also working on the hover class advanced cruiser. And the Caridus class, very interesting. This will, uh, well, probably change my entire fleet again. But I'm not going to be destroying them. If it happens that certain ships are destroyed and cannot be replaced, we'll deal with that. Let's improve the research because we are actually working that. And let's hope that we save up on enough influence to keep integrating this guy pretty fast. Considering he is, well, rather small... I don't think it will take that long. At least I hope not. Because it's um, semi-annoying. So we're building up the promenade. Promenade over here. We're building up this station. Who's going to be, by the looks of it, a naval depot. Mm, yeah, we'll just wait here. What I also would like to do is get all of these systems. Let's zoom out a bit. Because I'm thinking, yeah, this is definitely, there's just so much going on. Here we go, the new Hoover class, and something is... Oh, wow. Ooh, the, a new ship class. We've got the Eris class and the Miranda class. Man, this is the age of class. The ship retired. The NX class explorer has been marked for retirement. Oh, no. 
Uh, wow, some of these ships are absolutely cool. Yeah, they look fantastic. Yes. Oh wow, we got the Discovery. This this very much looks like the Discovery class. I like it. Uh, anything else that we can change with these? Have you explored Deep Space Explorer? That just sounds cool. Can we, can we do that uh, the jump thing? That would be that would be so nice. Um, warp speed or so, or, or range? Mm, not sure. I don't know. Oh, here is the one. Wow. Oh man, there's so many classes. Uh, the flagship still this one though. I'm I'm hoping we'll get the new one. That would be nice. That would be nice. We got the Vulcan Cruiser. Apparently, that's that's a stick. Interesting. Secondary hull. This is the only configuration available. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with that. Let's auto upgrade this one. Let's save. So, this is the Depol. Interesting. Depol is just the stick with a shell. Awesome. Explorer. Yeah, I quite like this. Um... Let's go with a heavy explorer then. So this is a lot of tracking. Will be ideal to deal with smaller targets. What kind of tracking? Where can we find the tracking? Oh well. We'll just see. All of this. Wait, why this one? Weapon damage or hull. I kind of like the hull. Yeah, this needs to be just maxed. And it's sensor range. Or warp speed. I always like to get this tech too, you know. This is all, all tech one. Once we get like a, a higher technology, that that would be cool. That would be very cool. Like this is a tracking too, and warp. I just, do we need the warp speed? We could also go for the engineering console. We'll get even more shields and armor. Sublight speed, yeah, this is the second tier, so that is quite nice. They are do insist on me getting this one. Why? Dilithium? Why? Why would I? They'll be in a fleet. So there's little point in doing that. The Explorer. Um, yeah, the only thing changed is like a torpedo. I kind of quite like to have uh, some of these smaller ships. Do something like this. Again, to change that. Mm. Shall we go with pure damage? I think I do want to do that. Warp speed is already increased. Shield hit points. The ship upkeep is negative and the sense range plus one. The length is 288 meters. That is some cool information. I was not aware of that. Very, very nice. Let's auto upgrade that. Let's save. And we have the advanced cruiser. Experimental. And the extended base. Focusing. Heavy. Actually, this is a lot of these uh, shuttles, right? Land the pot wing. Mm, 28 on 13. Uh, cooldown is 2. Cooldown is 2. These definitely are, are, are way better. This is a... a cr that damage though. Wow. Really like that. Yeah, we do need to get this one. The cross field. What kind of options do we have in here? Jump charge time. Guys, this is... This is the discovery. Jump drive down. We, we, they did have a lot of um, of fighters, as we could see in the uh, in the series, of course. Evasion plus fifteen. No. Can we use the jump charge to? Um... Mm, how to say this? Is it just jumping from one system to another, or it, it, does it really have a tactical advantage? We'll just leave it for now, the way it is, because I do like that. 
So here we go. We got the, um, the dis this, this must be like the discovery class. It has the jump drive. It has the spore drive. Love it. Just made sure that we uh, will we'll get a few done. Uh, let's not keep looking at that. Naval Logistics Center. It's going to be over there. We want to get the Naval Depot. Uh, where no man has gone before. Mm. No, I don't need these guys. Why do we keep on... Uh, try to the duration of three years. Deep space, so that's over here. Deep space, I would consider that the core. Uncharted space or new territories. Let's go to new territories. That one's going over here, and this one I'll take the. Orbital Hospital. What do we do with the others? Orbital Museum, Orbital Hospital. This one is going to be changed. Traffic control, I think. Let's go with the museum first. We'll do the orbital uh, other one first. Is this ex is this getting rid of my flagship? No. Not yet. The Constitution class is the next one. So yeah, we we got some things to do. Maybe this will change a lot of my fleets. I don't know if I'm going to be happy about that. Since the NX is out. Uh, but we're not... Since we can't retrofit... It's, it, it will have to do. It will have to do. And we'll create a new fleet once we have to. And build that up. ASAP. Promising. We got... Um, Sku... Shukar. Well, you guys know him better than I do. That's for sure. Starbase 12 is being upgraded. Nice. Uh, we can actually upgrade him. And we can buy some more alloys. Let's see. It, it's actually quite... Quite in the plus there. This we can never do. This one is available right now. Let's take it. So, upgrades can be completing. Wait, what? Oh, wait, yeah, of course. We had to build the, um, the Annex class again. Let's get, yes, Papella Giorgio. You, I like you. A lot. Let's make sure that we can recruit her. Come on. Please. Any day now. Um, cover the retreat. Oh, damn you. There we go. Let's get Giorgio. In there and go automatically explore wherever it is that you want to be going. New colony has been founded. Let's get rid of this. Let's zoom out a bit so my game isn't lagging like crazy. That's actually uh, what is a big cause of it though. There's just so much going on. And therefore uh, getting rid of most empires will probably fix it. But that is something for, uh, for the long run. What is this going to be? Upgrades almost done. It's still at 9.5. Don't really see too many changes. We got the cultural plaza now. Um, the research site, admin cap, military complex and fortress world. I want to have a few of those. Uh, since that will boost my naval cap a, uh, quite a bit. So let's upgrade. Let's uh, make sure that we get all of this going. We did spend a good amount of alloys there. We're not there yet. But hopefully we can actually start filling up. As you can see, we're slightly above our naval cap. Uh, but of course, we'll change that once this uh, goes into effect. Sometimes these things are just so slow. Uh, we, can we upgrade these yet? Planetary skill construction. That is a big ass no. Hmm. We'll just see. What's this? Start the survey. Hopefully he will live. 
Uh, Winslet has found a rare Gaia class world filled with life. Fascinating. But where is he again? Oh wait, he is uh, he is missing in action right now, doesn't he? We can actually upgrade the annex class. But we don't need to. Yeah, I wish that actually by retiring we could change the fleet. Now, I'm not fool enough uh, of myself to um, think that any of the devs are watching. But if they are, could you could you please could you could you change that? Please, please, because because now uh, if I want to have like the new class, like the new one, uh, like the carrying that class, which is um, or the hover class, I cannot just upgrade them. <laughs> it's so annoying. It really is annoying. So perhaps we'll just have to make another fleet. But first things first, we'll need to get the naval cap uh, a lot, lot larger. Uh, we can still build one more base, uh, but I'm not going to. You have a mega structure here, huh? Oh, speaking of which. How far are we? We're still lacking 245. Very close. Meeting place of the galactic powers, increasing immigration attraction and global opinion of us. Nice. Very nice. Uh, 245. Um, we cannot buy those. Which is slightly unfortunate. It must be dealt with. Let's pause here for a second. No, we can't buy those. Which is highly unfortunate. Where are those blood, blumby, bloody pirates? Um, so, by now, my pirates are weaker than my regular stations. Can you imagine that? What's the point in having pirates? None. No pirate point. And there's still a lot of this... Um, trade value just lying around here mm, promenade trading up plus three can we do something that will increase the range of those no we already have this so not yet okay we'll just have to wait we just have to wait and see what will happen uh, the first and second fleet will um, let's upgrade you again, and I think we should be very close now. Four ships remaining, which are by the looks of it about to be constructed. Zero alloy, so you should in theory be completely full, full strength, or we just cannot build some of these ships. Um, They were building the walker, the Bonova, the light cruiser. Yeah, we can't build those. It's it's a new class, which is very annoying. Meaning we'll have to dial you down to four. And we could possibly just add this. Making him the, the strongest in the fleet. Most likely. Can we add some more? Some, some newer class. The walker we have. Let's get the guardian class in here, if that's possible. No. Half a class, the DePaul class, that weird, weird looking thing. It's expensive. Yeah, expensive is good, right? Uh, we can add some uh, some light uh, frigates. Just to have a, um, a good share of things, why not? How about you? Are you missing something here? Can we advance to get you in there? Some of these. Uh, just the tiny ones, but looks of it. Not even that. Wow. Well, it appears that we'll need to spend another 1600. Look at all of these things done. And I'll promise I will just do those like off camera. I, 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 managing planets? I don't know, but I don't think anyone actually likes that. Uh, hostile fleet present. Yeah, we're not going to be bothering that. Go away. So please, let me, come on, give me integration options here. Naval, no, museum, orbital museum. Yeah, okay, the traffic control is nice, but personally, I still want the orbital hospital. Sorry. Uh, we'll get the um, the increased fleet uh, speed so, uh, soon. We'll get it, we'll get it. But not right now. 
Once we have... We're building up alloys, which is very nice, but we're not there yet. I... Ooh, minerals getting very low. But we'll, uh, we'll work that. It's fine. Fleet combat status. Yeah. Three of three. They died. I didn't think there was anything else going to happen. Get rid of this. Actually, that's quite loud. Let's go and do the effects. There you go. We already had that. Let's zoom out. Zoom out a bit more and just wait. Uh, how much are we now in strength? So they're now pathetic. Are strong. They are inferior in their the economy. Equivalent. The Klingons. His due. Oh my. Economy. Not so well on these guys. Sorry about that, uh, Chancellor Gowron. Inferior. Amazing. Yeah, actually, I want to see how much we can do to not get involved in wars and still be the largest. I wonder how long we can actually hold, keep that up. So yeah, new ships, classes, we've been building up the fleet. Uh, very uneventful, which is ex precisely what the United Federation of Planets is about. And uh, I have to do a lot of work here, as you can see, and changing some of these planets and making sure that my minerals is not going to be killing. We're actually they're doing the, Rever um, the Valerian free holes by the looks of it. They're on 63, let's go with a high intensity then. Where's the free hole? Oh, these guys. Ooh, that, that will definitely piss a few off. But they're all pathetic. They're like, yeah, maybe we should not do anything about this. And I approve. Hull breaching phases. Let's go with the, the very cheap one, which is done in two months. It's a joke. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. I'll do some of these uh, off camera and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye bye.